And folks, we welcome you to the field here at Tarboro High School for our internet exclusive Telco Crate Union Player of the Game. Tonight, the man who led the power running game for the Tarboro Vikings, Marquise Clapp, is joining us. Marquise, are you a bit chilly? Yeah, it's really cold out here. <laughs> well, luckily you guys set the field on fire, so that's a good thing. Uh, coming in, you know, Lewisburg, um, good football team. What'd you guys, what was your game plan going into the ball game tonight? Well, just stop their, their play called the Sally and their sweeps to the outside. And just basically key on our keys, read our keys, and play football like we've been doing. Marquise, early on you scored the first touchdown of the ball game. You kind of got this whole train running. Uh, did you know early on you had a big night in you? <laughs> nah, I didn't at first, but once I scored that first touchdown, I knew I had a big night coming ahead of me. And Marquise, now you guys next week for what you've done, you get a trip down to James Keenan for the third round of the playoffs. Hey, man, when you get the third round, you're supposed to play good teams. Uh, how you guys feeling uh, going into the third round? Uh, I feel like that we're ready to play, take on them, and we're going to beat them. Yeah. Can't say it any better, can you, man? Folks, Marquise Clapp, we're going to call him Spider-Man tonight with a mask up here. Uh, great ball game, pair of touchdowns, held pace this Tarboro attack tonight. They run up, around, and over the Lewisburg Warriors. Marquise, thank you so much. Our Telco Crate Union player of the game. This has been Internet Exclusive, all-new sports show. It's not Internet Exclusive. Okay, back to the studio.